Hi everybody, this is Patrick McGuire with the North Shores Real Estate Group. I am here uh, by myself today to do the market report. Uh, Pat Marka can't be with us, but uh, I'm going to hold down the fort and I'll bring you three properties today that we can kind of talk about. Uh, the first is in Groveland. It's over at 698 Salem Street. It's a nice little section of Groveland um, when you go into a, towards Bradford. And I picked this property because uh, it's a little unusual. So there's actually two houses on uh, two separate lots. but They're connected by a septic. Um, so you get the main house here, and then you kind of got a little uh, cottage in the back. This is priced at uh, just under 400000 And as we can see from the pictures, so this is the main house here. Uh, nice construction. It might need a little updating. Um, we can kind of treat this as a two-family a little bit. Or if you have, you know, your parents you're going to live with, um, someone that would be moving in with you that would like, you know, their own living space, you can kind of put them out uh, in this cottage area. And it looks like it, it does have its own kitchen, its own, you know, bath and everything. So they're completely self-sufficient self out there. And the listing does say that you're getting about uh, $1,200 a month uh, for that little cottage. So you could also use it as a rental property if you just wanted to uh, supplement the mortgage with it. Uh, so it's a nice uh, little place. It's, it's different to see the, the two families over in the Groveland area. Uh, so this is something a little bit unusual, especially since it's two separate houses. Um, but if you're looking for an investment property, or you might you know, have an opportunity where you live with a family member or a friend, uh, this might be something you would be interested in. And I guess it's in Groveland. It's on for the 400000 You know, the second one? All right. My second one is 15 Leather Lane. It's over in Beverly. So this is on for one point, basically 1.3 million, and mostly you'll see it's all about the land. It's got 12 acres on it. Uh, the house in front, it looks like the land um, kind of corrals it in a horseshoe. I would think it's not subdividable, because if it was, they would probably sell it that way. Uh, but that's something you could look into. Um, possibility to be a horse property if you need the land or you know something else uh, you certainly have the acreage there you can see a little map I believe the house is in this little square here and then the land kind of wraps around it and this also has a little um, secondary living area off the side so we have the main house as you can see in these pictures you have a big uh, two-car garage lots of land and then uh, off to the side here you have another little, little living area and I'm not sure if this one has a kitchen or not uh, but certainly a little in-law if you need it um, a space to uh, maybe house guests. They have their own little space. Um, maybe some updating to it. Uh, the kitchen looks all completely updated. Uh, but again, this is kind of about the outside space, about the land. Uh, this is over right before you go into uh, Manchester. And you can see just a real stunning uh, piece of property there. And again, this is on for uh, $1.3 million. And our last one. So the last one's a condo. Um, I've actually been going out and looking at a lot of condos in the area lately. So I feel like this this seems like something um, that will hit the market and go pretty quickly. It's on for 270. Um, it's the 1800 square feet. It is a duplex. Uh, so small association. The associations fee about 240. Uh, but just the the amount of space and how it's kept. You can see from these pictures. Uh, just looks gorgeous inside. They did a great job. It looks like they staged it. Uh, very clean, kept, um, really a nice space so you can kind of spread out in. To get that 1,800 square feet in a condo uh, is really something people are looking for and you can, really can't find it that often. It's also a great space downtown Beverly. It's right on um, Federal. I don't even know if I said the address. Uh, it's 39 Federal Street Unit 2. And um, really a, a cool opportunity. The, the one drawback, it does have one parking space only, uh, but most of the time besides the winter, you could probably just you know park right there on Federal Street. All right, so that's it for uh, this week's uh, market report. Uh, we'll be back. Hopefully Pat will be with me next time, and uh, we'll talk about some more property. All right, see you then.